cassava is a major food security crop for over 300 million people in Africa, contributing to food security, livelihoods, and income. The crop is grown mainly by smallholder farmers. In 2013, global production of cassava was approximately 276 million metric tons, with Africa accounting for 158 million metric tons, which was about 57%. Though Africa controls the larger share of cassava production, yield per hectare is half of those of Asian countries. One major factor that has contributed to low yields of cassava is poor weed control. One of the constraints to increase cassava production and productivity is weeds. Weeds in cassava farms. Weeds are a major problem in cassava. I will give you a typical example. There is this common weed around that is called Titonia diversifolia. Titonia grows very fast, that within three weeks or four weeks is almost approaching the height of a human being. So if you have that in a cassava field, uh, if you don't control it, the cassava is definitely going to suffer. For most farmers, hand pulling and hoeing of weeds are well established practices. Weeding takes 50 to 80 percent of the total labor budget of cassava growers, and women contribute more than 90 percent of the hand weeding. In several cases, cassava farms are abandoned, or children between the ages of 5 and 14 are forced to leave school and engage in weeding. In the last two years, the IITA Cassava Weed Management Project is assessing sustainable weed management technologies for cassava farming systems in Nigeria. The aim of the project is to develop environmental friendly weed control options to address the weed menace by increasing the productivity of cassava while minimizing the drudgery of hand weeding by women and children. Cassava is a, the number one poverty fighter in Nigeria and in Africa. This was already known since 2003 in the, what they call the Maputo Declaration in which it was stated that cassava, if efforts are put into its improvement in terms of increases productivity, adding value, it will generate income, it will alleviate poverty and in fact it was rated number one, um, followed by maize and rice. The project is employing best bet agronomic practices, mechanical weed control, use of safe and environmental friendly herbicides, as well as integrated weed control, with a view to preserving the natural resource base. My experience with mechanical weeding machine is very good faster and very economical. Then the time you spend on a mechanical machine is very low than 
the way you spend on a all weeding or and weeding. Preliminary results show that mechanical weeding holds promise. The ongoing testing is exciting to women and the youth as the equipment offers less drudgery compared with hand and hole weeding. Besides, the project is working with Nigerian engineers and its national partners to develop mechanical weeding solutions that can be applied on large-scale farms.